Hello, 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 hello. Hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel. Let's talk World Cup this morning. Let's talk World Cup. Is it out of here? Yes. Happy Sunday, wherever you're watching me. I am Sherry Belgian. I bring you news from all around the world. Sometimes beauty, sometimes gossip, sometimes calls, and anything that I find interesting that I can bring to the platform, I bring. Now, guys, let's talk about the World Cup. You know Cameroon is on the lamb light, yes, as to be the first African, the first African team to win or to score a goal against Brazil. Now, why am I making this live? I'm making this live because of this thing between a Pasi Onana Song, the captain of the Indomitable Lions. Yes, you guys know that. Um, just of recent, within the last match, Onana was replaced. And why was he replaced? For those of you who do not know, it was said Onana was replaced because Onana gave his objective view about what is happening and why there's so many defeats. I don't know if Onana put it in a way that was not presentable, but at the end of the day, we realized that I'm going against the crowd because I know everybody's just going like, epasi, 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 but today I'm going against the crowd. I'm going my own way. I'm a one man shoulder in this video. Now, but at the end of the day, we see this match got victory because some of the things that Onana put or suggested were put in place for this victory to come. Now, what did Onana say? It is said many write-ups. You can go find World Cup and you can find many posts. Many bloggers are posting this. Onana said there was a loophole regarding the defense lineup, that the defense lineup is weak. And the way the players are passing the ball between each other makes team like makes him um 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 uh, um not able to to be the to bring out the best in him. Number one, that the lineup is wrong. Okay, so many people will say yes. Maybe Onana coming forward to say the lineup of the the match was wrong is like challenging the coach like telling the coach the coach does not know what he is doing like song and maybe song got angry and maybe decided to replace him don't forget that we have been playing matches and we have been winning we have been playing matches or not really winning we have been playing matches and onana has been doing his best like he has been he has he's a good goalkeeper he's a good goalkeeper but what surprises me most now is what surprises me most now is the way Cameroonians are jubilating over the fact that he has been replaced and not only that the way they are praising a passy hmm. I read under some post they said ah oh nana Please come, come, come and go quickly so that um, uh, a persist light can shine. You were the one blocking a persist light, a persist light. Because you were because you have been replaced now, a persist light can shine brighter. Everywhere on the internet, every block, every post, every news is just carrying the thing like, hey, a Pasi is the best, a Pasi is skilled, a Pasi is this, a Pasi is the best goalkeeper that we could ever have because of this one match. Because of this one man, like we throw everything that uh, Onana has been doing, or maybe Onana didn't even present this thing well to or present his opinion well to the coach. But I would say there are two sides of the coins. Either he presented the his his, his worry wrongly, or he was being misunderstood. And two people are at fault here. In the case that he presented his case, he presented his worry negatively, maybe impolitely, he was wrong. The other part, I see Song being wrong. Many people will say, um, Song, that is good. Song is doing something very good because he is the, or the first coach to discipline um, 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 people that um, 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 uh, we only, Africans only listen to or you or Bodo, you go to white coaches, but because it's a black coach setting this example on Nana is a very good. I don't see it. There are some certain problems that could be 
He could allow Onana to play. Allow Onana to play because as he stands now, I hear he, he has been he has been maybe maybe even withdrawn and maybe kept somewhere for and it's going to be a long time. If I was so, if you're a leader and your coach, what I would do is I would um try to solve this problem. I would allow him do what he knows how to do, allow him play the match, allow him catch, and then we sort out the problem behind the scenes. It's a small problem that could have been sorted out behind the scenes. Like call him and say, man, you are a young guy. You don't talk like that to your coach. You don't teach your coach what um, um, he or she is, or, or your, what he's supposed to do. That is a, a, a good way. Tell him like that. You, there are many ways of penalizing a child when a child goes wrong, you know. But going ahead to say, um, after that, some criticisms have gone to Song and Song has come out and say they prioritize the group and not individuals, which is good. We have to prioritize the group and not individuals. But at the same time, you don't have to penalize an individual over something that could be easily handed, handled behind the scenes and not cause a stare over the social media or, 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 or the world at large. I'm a me, the English I talk about. You see, guys, so I don't see why everybody is like just cursing on Nana, cursing on Nana. He's a very rude boy. He's a very disobedient boy. He's indisciplined because of money. He he, he, he treats people like shit because of money. He doesn't listen to, to nobody. He thinks he has arrived the peak of his career. And this was the best decision to pull him down. It's disgraceful. It's shameful and all of that. And at the same time, they are hailing a Pasi. Ooh, a Pasi is the best. Where was where has a Pasi been? A Pasi star has been uh, been because of, of, of Onana. Thank God that Onana caused this scene so a Pasi's light can be seen, and that they should maintain a, a Pasi tear thy kingdom come. That is not the way things should be done. I believe that. And if you look critically, this last match was won. Why? Why? Uh, like uh, Abu, uh, Abu Bakr uh, 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 gave the match a win. If you look at the defense lining, and if you look at the, the way they go, the, the, the players were passing the ball to each other, you will see that if truly Onana presented this thing as a weakness in the defense lineup and as weakness in the way the players were passing the ball, then the coaches used his worry. They use what is presented as his worry to the weakness of the group. Why many why many teams are, 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 are giving them a, a win? Why they they, they, they won them up in in, 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 in in South Korea while other countries are, are, are scoring many goals? Because he is a goalkeeper. Yes, he's supposed to defend the goal, but he cannot do that alone. If the defense lineup is not strong enough and if the players do not know how to pass the ball or if they are selfish with the ball, if they just carry the ball and just go, they want to be the, the person that who, who, who scored that goal, then at the end of the day, he's standing alone and he's defenseless. He cannot defend. He cannot... He cannot defend himself without a weak defense. Yes, like, am I seeing, am I making sense? He cannot be successful. He cannot do what we want him to do. Like, bring out the best in him if the defense line up is not in place or if it's not good. Yes, this video is not meant to be long, but it's just meant to bring out a point as to pair what I see online these days. Everybody is a passy up, a passy, a passy, or a passy, a passy this, a passy that, a passy this, a passy that, a passy is the best, a passy that this. They should not they should take care of a passy. They should line up a passy every match. Every no, 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 no. We don't just do that. Oh, Nana is a good goalkeeper. He has done it for us. He has been there for us. He has caught. He has he has given us so many victories. Why is it now just because of this one thing that, oh, oh, oh Nana was dimming the light of Epasi and now Epasi is on the side. This is what will cause a lot of jealousy and will bring strife and all of that. This small, small problem is that the coach, I blame the coach here very much. I blame the coach here. There's, there are many ways you can use to discipline. There are many ways you can use to discipline your players. This problem could have been handled behind like, the uh, 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 song could have talked it out with um, Onana behind the scenes penalize him behind the scenes and still let him be or there have been a swap or switch or something they would have done something not to make one person feel like relegated to the background or like feel like cut off completely you get what i say you get what i'm bringing to the table
Yes, guys, what are your what are your opinions and your say regarding this match and regarding this um and uh, replacement of Nana with a Pasi and how the general population and how Cameroonians are reacting to this? What is your say? Did Song act was his decision to like just cut him off completely and there is a post running around that he's going to be cut off for a while to teach him a lesson. Do you guys think that this is the right way of solving this problem? Do you think that this is the right approach for the coach to have uh, settled this problem, even if Onana was indisciplined and disrespectful? Don't you guys think that it would have been better? It's a small problem that could have been handled behind the scenes because it is a large now. Everybody is just, everybody is just pressing. That's, it's like they've just forgotten Onana. Over because over a passy for one match. So I want to know your view about this, and I want to know your opinions about how the coach handled this, and what are the weaknesses you see in the Indomitable Lions, and what are some of the um, suggestions or uh, yeah suggestions that can be can be put in place because social media is doing a great deal this day. With social media, messages can go viral and. Yes, yeah, song might fall on some messages or some suggestions, and it might better help him manage a team well and manage the players well. But as for me, it's a no for this complete cutoff, and it's a no for me. I will not press. I will say a passy is good, but I will not say he's so good more than Onana. No, because Onana has been there, and Onana is a good player, and all of us we acknowledge the fact. But just because of this. This instance, just because of this situation, everybody has thrown him behind the background. I one person out there when everybody is going this way. I, I always like to look at the other side. I always like to look at the other side. Yes, it's not because of this one situation that we just mm, 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 oh no, no, is this. So, guys, if you happen to watch this video, leave your comment below, leave your suggestion below. What do you think can be done to this group, to this team, to make it better? How do you think? What is your suggestion? How was Song supposed to handle this matter? Did he handle this matter correctly by just replacing and cutting off and saying that he is going to be penalized for a while to teach him a lesson? Or are there other means or other measures that could have been taken to better the situation? With that being said, let's go over to Liberia. George Weah, the president, His Excellency, the president of Liberia. <laughs> if you guys are on TikTok, you would have met this guy. There's one one guy, one particular guy. I will single in, single him out. He has caused a stir around all back Cameroon on his TikTok. I don't know his name. I'm not coming to give him popularity. I don't know his name. But the way this guy brought down Cameroon, the way he insulted Cameroon. The way he insulted Cameroon, insulted the president, insulted our resources, insulted our English, insulted everything about Cameroon, insulted even our players. I was thinking that, ah, maybe Liberia will be better. But to my greatest surprise, to my greatest, is it surprise again? What, how should I call it? I saw the son to the president of Liberia bearing the nationality of an, an, another country playing for another country with him if this guy is supposed to uh, introduce himself like how will he introduce himself I don't even know I am where you are he really carries the name behind his t-shirt. He's Jesse. I am Weya. My father is the president of um, USA. My father is the president of Liberia. I am one of the best players in the USA. So your president or you people can choose a nation, can choose, um, uh, 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 you, you can choose family over a nation. You can choose. Yes, that's what he did. He chooses his son over a whole nation because it's disgraceful i think he's supposed to, he's supposed to be replacing if he was playing for liberia i would have been applauding I, i'm i'm making this comment just because of this guy on tiktok i would have been applauding that oh this if he was playing for his nation you know the way he would have been lifting up liberia what a shame that the first son is not even a liberian the first son 
is a national of another country and bringing victory in another country and is being celebrated by the, 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 the his excellency in another country how does that even sound how does that even work how does that even make sense it's a shame and it's a disgrace for me you this guy on tiktok saying that cameroon is this cameroon is that this one should just help you to shut up your mouth this one should just help you to zip because it's disgraceful had it been I'm the president or the first lady of Cameroon, I will make sure that every one of my children represent Cameroon in, in all their glory. In all their glory. But the way you went about ranting, insulting, Cameroonians cannot even speak English, Cameroonian president, our grandpapa, our this, our that, insulting the players, Alexa, Ben, the this, the, ah, ah. Cameroonians are so stupid and foolish. That is why we can never have victory. Now this victory that Cameroon brought, the, the ever first African and team to score a goal against Brazil. What do you have to say about this? Please come and make a video about it. Oh. Because all of this one act of having a first son playing and having a nationality of another country is disgraceful. It's a shame. It's a total shame and disgrace for life. Like you, you choose, you choose. I, I, I don't even know. I don't even know how that is his victory. Eh? It was, it was, he had better been kept silent. Like it had better been kept quiet, like than bringing it. And people were like, ah, what is this? This victory should have been my son is playing for my country and my son is bringing the glory to my country. Patati patata. Not my son is playing for the U.S. team and my son is not even a national of Liberia. My son is an American. Eee! My dear people, this one break my skin. It break my body. It break my body. It break my body. Where will you? It's a shame and a disgrace, so oh. total shame and a disgrace. I hope that this I would I will make sure I share this video so that this video meets you in that TikTok so that you would come and make another video and, and give Cameroon that respect that it deserves because we have brought we are now the, the giant of, 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 of Africa. Yes, because we brought that cup, we brought that glory to Africa back with Abu Bakr. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We did it. We did it. So my fellow librarians, my fellow those that were criticizing Cameroon, what do you have to say? What do you have to say concerning this act of being a president in another country and your son is having a national of another country and even bringing victory for another country? Do you, do you look at it as something that is good or I don't know, leave your honest your honest judgment your honest comments in my comment section don't ignore this video because as for me i see this act of your president of liberia i see it as a disgraceful act i see it as like choosing your son over a whole nation yes choosing your son over a whole nation like i don't know why i should be a president of cameroon and my son would, would, be, would, be, would, be, would be defending another country no 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 it doesn't represent now nah. It doesn't represent at all, at all. It doesn't represent. Yes, this Liberian guy, this Liberian guy is on TikTok. Everybody, most many people have seen this video. He insulted Cameroon, insulted Cameroon, brought Cameroon down. All sort of insults. But this is one insult that is big. I don't know as I can, I can, I can, I can qualify this insult. It's an insult that, I don't know the name to give to this insult. It's a terrible one. It's a terrible one, misplaced. I don't know if it, I, I should call it misplaced. I don't know how I can call it. You give me, leave your comments in the comment section below. Yes, guys, leave your comments in the comment section below. Yes, guys. Okay. Yes, guys, that was it. I wanted to do a very short video. Let me know what you think about a song's action and the penalization of... Is it penalization? Hey, Grandma A. And... Um, um, sorry, sorry for the noise. Sorry for the noise. Let me know what you think about this, um, sanction if it's 
right if there was a better way sorry my son is crying if there was a better way of doing this leave them in the comment section thank you for watching and like i said I, i'm always here for a very short time short lives oh sorry my son is crying okay don't have a blessed day and leave your comments below